Yo, what up, it's Don. Sammy Lee here. Soul Brothers. What up? We want to see what is the fastest lacing, if you guys care Ooh. about that. Uh, also, I mean, like, lacing is nice. Oh, I forgot the Jordan 33. You want to get those? Yeah. Right over there. Obviously, there's that. Forgot about that. I can't forget about the 33s, man. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, <clears throat> so we wanted to see which one was the fastest. And also, uh, it's not it's not all about having the fastest lacing, like I would say. I, I mean, it is convenient, but also like how easy is it to put on and is it supported? You know what I'm saying? Because like lacing and stuff like that can also like dictate how uh, supported the, the, the actual shoe is like on your foot, you know? So we have a variety of shoes here. You know, the Soldier 12 with the straps, strappy straps. You got the Adapt Basketballs. You got the KD-11, which is really easy to just slide on, but you just have laces. You have a traditional just lacing system. You know, obviously just a ton of laces. You got Adidas Next Level, which Adidas is saying is the future, which I, I don't re really agree with, but you got that. And also, also, obviously, you got the Jordan 33. Yeah, fast fit system, pull it to tighten it. Yes. Pull the cord to loosen it. Yes. The Adidas um, uh, next level, obviously, being laceless, yes. lack of laces altogether. Exactly. Um, so you go all the way from having zero laces to a shoe that just does automatic lacing. Yes. Um, which is pretty crazy. Yes. So let's get it start off with the just the Wow 7. If you guys want to cop this, shout out to Cell Night Station. We'll leave a link in the description box. But you know, uh, it's pretty easy to put on. Just do your laces like that, tighten it, boom, lace it. It's probably like the slowest, right? Yeah. So that was like what, four or five seconds, I think. Mm -hmm. So not too bad, but um, lockdown and everything is really good. It's gonna be kinda, to untie it, you have to untie the laces, loosen everything up, obviously just like regular shoes and you take your foot out, you know? That's probably like the slowest you're gonna get, right? So there's that. Let's move on to the next shoe, which is the KD-11. KD-11 is basically the same thing, but it has a stretchy knit upper, so it's kind of like a little bit faster because you can stretch the knit. You, know? yeah, you don't have to deal with the tongue. You don't need to like fully unlace like the top eyelets. Exactly. And, kinda, and it kind of unloosens itself, a lot of the one booty uppers even. Yeah, so it's a little bit faster, a little bit more convenient than uh, than the uh, just traditional tongues, you know? So you kind of just stretch it out like this and slide your foot in. Uh, the KD-11 is a little hard though. And you slide it in. And usually most of the time right here, it stays tight. So you just kind of have to do like the top two late eyelets. You just... Lace it up, boom. I say a little bit faster, right? Um, but to take it out, the same thing. Heel lockdown is good, so loosen the laces. Boom. First two eyelets and boom. There you go. Uh, I'd say it's like around the same, but I, yeah. I'd say it's a little bit more comfortable because I like to feel that knit stretching over, over my foot, so it feels a little bit nicer for fit, mm -hmm. you know? All right, next shoe is the LeBron Soldier 12. LeBron Soldier 12 is just the one booty upper with two straps. So you just do that. And then you just slide your foot in super fast. Yeah, also no tongue, full one booty upper. Yes. Uh, two straps, lock it down on the Velcro. Pretty fast, would you say faster? Uh, yeah, a lot faster. Yeah. yeah, you just boom, you're good. And lockdown is great in that shoe. Lockdown is real nice. You know, you have the extra straps to, you know, tighten, actually tighten on something, you know, unlike the next levels, which you can't really adjust the fit, you know? So that's a little nice bonus with the straps. Boom, boom, real, real quick. Okay, now you have the next levels, which obviously is laceless. So you can just, at first it's really, really hard to um, put it on because it's really tight. But once you break it in, it gets a lot easier like that. And it's just- and that's it, you're done. That's it, you're done. You know, and support and all that, it's really good. It's all there, which which I think is a plus. You know, that's really good. But like. What if you're, what if the, the, the fit isn't that good? What if it's a little roomy? That's the problem. You know, you can't adjust it. It's not gonna work for every foot. Exactly. It can't. Exactly. So that's what kind of sucks about this shoe. I mean, it's really nice for me, supporting all that. It's really, it's really good, it's all there. But I imagine for some people, it's not gonna be very good. 
Some you know? people it'll choke out. Some people might even be too loose for it. Exactly. Like if you had a crazy narrow foot, and exactly. like me, I have a pretty narrow foot, and I really like to crank my crank my laces down. Yeah. And I sometimes max out, and I end up choking the eyelids out, and I'm still you're not gonna put an insole. So you know it's just way too many different sizes foot. So yeah, exactly. So that's it's like it's like basically like the crazy explosive, but without laces. Like, yeah. uh, what? Well, why? You know, just keep the laces there, and it will be. And you don't need to use them if yeah. you want to use them. You can exactly. You know what I'm saying? So or maybe just add a little strap or One something. Strap, yeah. You know, just like the Soldier Twelve. I mean, they kind of did something here, but like. No, be cool. What? Is if they did like a <laughs> strap. That was like, uh, you know, it went through like a slot and mm -hmm. came back and Velcroed. Mm -hmm. um, but it was like very like stretchy, like a spandex. Yeah. And you can adjust the tightness of it. So you didn't need to open it and close it every time. Mm -hmm. Just like mm -hmm. if you wanted it to be tighter yeah, or looser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that would be pretty dope. Yeah. That's actually a good idea. Of course, you have the Jordan 33. You know, you have the, what is it, fast fit? Fast fit, fast system. fit system. You have this little strap that you have to do first. So you put it on right and then you have this strappy strap so you have to strap that boom and then that's it yeah i'd say it's pretty fast not as fast as the obviously the next levels but it's a lot faster than lace lacing except uh, for putting that little strap in but yeah a plus with this is now if you're talking about tightening and loosening your shoes as you play which uh, you know is something that is done you know your yeah. foot swells up after maybe a long time or you know the laces, the, the laces can loosen the shoe can loosen so you want to crank it up now the fast fit system is one of the best with that because you can just tighten it and loosen it in milliseconds it's real fast you yeah. just go that's it well i mean it's already tight but yeah you know that's it you know yeah. and if you want to take it off you just go boom eject the thing uh unstrap the strappy strap right take your foot out pretty yeah. damn simple and yeah, I, I wouldn't say it's the quickest um, for putting it on and stuff, but like it's the quickest to re -tighten. Yeah. Now, I guess the Soldier 12 is real quick too. Yeah. Um, next level is actually the fastest because you can't re -tighten, you yeah. know what I'm saying? But yeah, but it comes at a price, yeah, you can't, it's not customizable. Yeah, and of course, last but not least is the Adapts. Which it's, is gonna be the slowest, right? Yeah, I mean, the, the, the actual tightening mechanism is really slow. It's like, yeah. eh, it takes like 10 seconds. So, uh, Putting it on first, it sucks. It's pretty hard. And a lot of the times, it's not... Oh, it's actually getting a lot faster. So it obviously senses your foot. You don't do anything. Yeah. It goes to your preferred tightness. Yes. Um, you know, that, that's actually not... Because, you, you know, once you put it on, you're done. Yeah. You're, you're done with the shoe. Yeah. Which is... I, I never really thought about that. It does take a little bit for it to tighten up. But you don't have to do it. You don't, you know, personally have yeah. to do it. You just... Slide your foot and it goes in and it's automatic. Which you, is you sound really like nice Robocop. <laughs> yeah. But other than that. Yeah. Uh, so, and then tightening it and loosening it, well, adjusting tightness is very quick. Yeah. Push of the button. I mean it doesn't move super fast, but it's just a push of the button. You you don't need to unlace yeah. and then retighten and then relace. But what's kind of annoying is like you know when you hold one button to tighten or loosen? Uh, if you hold it for like a second or two, it just automatically goes to your like. If you uh, hold the button to loosen, it just automatically all the way loosens up. So which yeah, kind of like, sucks. Yeah, you have to be really careful not to hold it too long. Yeah, because then you're going to exactly. full on loose. But sometimes you want to hold it until you want it to be loose. Exactly, you're like a little bit looser. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So it goes in and it goes all the way. But one thing you can do is just like press the tighten button again and it stops. That's right. just annoying, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So I, would, I don't know how they would fix that, but you know, I think they should fix that because that's kind of annoying. Um, also, another thing is like, it's really hard to find like the perfect fit. Yeah, it is. Like, um, it, it's, it, like when it's too loose, it's too loose. But then you, I, I go to tighten it and it feels pretty good. I'm like, oh, it's tight now. It feels nice, I'm not too tight or anything. But then I keep playing in it and then my foot falls asleep and I get needles. So yeah, it's like really hard to find the perfect thing, you know? Yeah, one of the things is like with the tra with traditional laces, yeah. you can tighten at each eyelet. Yeah. You know, loosen this eyelet, tighten this eyelet, and people, like I said, have different shaped size feet. And some people got a fat foot, some people got a skinny foot, so you can really customize the fit. That doesn't really happen here. Yeah. It's a, you know, one size fits all lacing system. Yeah. That just kind of does the whole forefoot. My foot was falling asleep for sure in that yeah. shape. So it's, it's kind of hard to find that perfect fit to where you don't get needles, but also you don't feel like really loose. 
So uh, I feel like lacing, you can kind of like, you can't pull like super hard as hard as this gear system does, you know what I'm saying? So, um, but anyways, the fastest definitely is the next levels, but you do sacrifice, uh, I guess, customizable fit. Mm -hmm. But obviously this is the f best, you can just slide it in. Um, but uh, one thing that the Soldier 12 does is, ba it's basically the same thing, dude. Yeah. One booty upper, you just slide on, but then it has straps where you can tighten it and adjust the fit. And it's like not that much slower. The Soldier 12 might be the all around best lacing, lacing system. system. Yes. As far as speed, customizability yeah and um just ease and just ease of use yeah exactly so uh i think the soldier 12 wins i really like the soldier uh, series where they they you know experiment with straps instead of laces um they did have some weird ones but the 12 does it really really well i also really like the 33 though 33 is also really nice yeah you know the 33 i think is like the craziest and you can really, really crank this down and tighten yeah. if you if you really want to, um, but definitely not the fastest and stuff like that. But I think these are definitely innovations yeah. uh, and things that are a little bit better than just tradi traditional lacing systems. You and know? you know the 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 adapts are in their infancy, yeah. and it's going to get to a point that it's just you know a second to tighten, a second to loosen, like Back to the Future. That'd be dope. Um, that would be dope. And, and but if you want to turn heads. The BB adapts all the way. Yeah, I mean, you, you want that E for 10 I mean, it's seconds. a crazy thing. It lights <laughs> up. Um, but anyways, what do you guys think is the future? Just regular lacing, um, no laces, which Adidas says is the future, which I heavily disagree on. Yeah. You, uh, well, is it is it you know a pulley system that's really fast? Is it the Soldier Twelve with straps, or is it you know? automatic laces with the fit adapt system tell us what you guys think uh is the future down in the comment section below but that's it thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys next one later Peace.